Hello and welcome back to JSA TV where we are coming to you live from the showroom floor at Yada 2024. The showroom floor doors have just opened, but my next guest here, Jeff Potter with ECS, uh, can let can confirm it's already crazy in here. It is. Uh, and I mean that in the very positive sense of the way. So thank you very much for making your way over and chatting with us, thank Jeff. Thank you, Keely. Appreciate it. So, okay, I've, I've walked by your booth. You, you guys have the booth here on the expo floor, and there's a lot going on over there, and I want to get into that for a minute. You have something that looks like a huge water tank over there. What's happening over there? Yeah, no, it's great. We're uh, demonstrating our immersion cooling solution with our ECS server submerged in a liquid stack tank. This is a 4U tank that... Uh, it is basically running right now on an AI workload, so it's actually in motion as you as we speak. And the great thing about it is the small size of that, you can use it for uh, any sort of edge deployment or small scale data centers. Um, but we also do much larger da data center deployments as well with immersion cooling. Uh, it's a great uh, solution in terms of it saves energy over air cooled solutions by up to 40%. It also allows you to um, uh, scale up and and produce more uh, server uh, scalability and density in those spaces. So it's a great solution uh, for data centers or enterprise data centers that wish to uh, save energy costs and, and increase their operating. Well, and so many are having initiatives around that right now and um, need companies like yours to help put that into action. So it's really great work that you're doing. Thank you. We should pause there for a moment and you just kind of let on, but for those who may not be familiar with ECS and what you're doing. Can you just explain a little bit more about how you're helping your customers? Yeah, for sure. So we're a solutions integrator. We work with partners, wide ecosystem of partners, everything from AI to ML deployments, 5G cybersecurity, uh, liquid cooling. So the whole gamut. And uh, yeah, we're continuing to grow and innovate and build new solutions for, for the marketplace. And it's, it's a really fun time to be at ECS. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a lot of fun to sit back and watch and see what you, you're doing as for well. Sure. You do have another, jumping back to the booth here at the expo floor at uh, Yada, you do have another really cool thing happening over there. We talked about the liquid cooling tank that you guys have got. And then you've got something else that looks like a, a router, like a small, sleek router. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, so that's our uh, ECS Edge Connector. And it's basically a 5G network appliance. Uh, it's powered by Intel processors and also secured by Zscaler, Zero Trust Architect platform. So it's a great uh, solution for many sectors that want to transmit data securely and quickly. Uh, it's small size. We also have an eight-core solution. So depending upon the environment and space that you need to use it, uh, it's just, it's a fantastic um, solution right now. And we're really proud to work with our partners on that. Yeah, very good. So let's switch gears just a little bit and talk about AI. It's the hot topic. Everybody here at Yada is talking about it. Of course, it's been a trending topic for about a year now. So how, how do you see ECS fitting into that space and how are you incorporating that and working with it? Yeah, it's a great question. So, I mean, we're at a show dedicated to AI infrastructure. That's what we do. And uh, like I mentioned, we uh, partner with, with various companies and our customers to make sure that we can develop those AI solutions that meet their needs. We also have an innovation lab where we test all those solutions before they go to market just to make sure that it is meeting their needs and, and customized options. Um, but, you know, everything that's happening right now with, uh, you know, large learning models, uh, generative AI, uh, AI enhanced uh, autonomy, all these areas are continuing to develop and get adopted. And you'll start to see these sectors that see the productivity growth, see the lower cost of operating costs, and then um, just overall benefits to the business. This will continue to happen. Yeah. So it sounds like you think we're just brushing the tip of the we iceberg are, right sure. now. Yes. And it's uh, really going to bring a lot of changes our way in the industry. Definitely. Yeah. Well, we look forward to seeing how you guys continue to work with it. Before we let you go, is there anything else that you want to let our viewers know about what you're working on? Uh, I think you should stop by our booth at 510. It's, uh, it's a great setup. And then follow us online or on LinkedIn, and you'll find out on a daily basis all the stuff that we're working on. Absolutely. Well, Jeff, thanks so much for stopping by JSA TV and have a good time. I'm going to make my way over there a little bit later when I'm, when I'm done here so you can show me the demo. It sounds really amazing. So, yes, absolutely. Stop by if you're here at the show or check them out online if you are not. But thanks again for joining us. Thanks, Kelly. Appreciate and it. Thanks to our viewers for tuning in. Don't go anywhere. We've got a lot more to come here from Yada 2024. In the meantime, stay curious and stay connected, everyone.